Their love story begins 12 years ago with two shy teenagers standing around a kitchen bench. We were still at high school and she was home for the holidays and I was helping with the kettle yards and that. Chris was busy reading the book, Lisa was, I don't know what she was doing, but there was definitely no conversation. I thought, holy f Back then, they were both firmly in the friend zone. But you could see, she had a bit of a thing for this guy from her cuckoo. When I finally got around to asking Becca if I could marry his daughter, it was in that same kitchen. How many times did you chase me around the farm looking for me? <laughs> I got this sudden feeling like now's the time to start. I got a big idea in my head. I got a dream down in my heart. I'm praying that she'll help me now. I'm praying that she'll show me. Probably Lisa's father. Claire's a mother. Lisa is a sensitive, loving, caring girl. And I'll tell you what. If she's got a mindset to do something, she will bloody will do it. In 2012, I first met Lisa. How lucky was I to meet someone that loved drawing silly little pictures, meerkats, and gin just as much, if not more than me. Lisa, lovely, patient Lisa. I admire your creativity, energy, and patience. You are going to need it. No one can guarantee that marriage will be easy, but one thing I can promise you is that living with Chris, it will never be dull. Anyway, I've known Chris from the very first days of high school. And we've had those days and we've stood up and we've had to talk to the class and say a little bit about it ourselves and Chris has been a little bit like this. Hi, my name's Chris. I like knives. Chris, it's been 10,221 days since you were born. I was a rookie parent and I'm sad to say that I did most of my learning on you. <laughs> we homeschooled for four years and watching you thrive was very rewarding. Learning for you was taking everything to bits to see how it worked. The unfortunate thing is that Chris is a fussy bastard like me. But you know what? There's nothing f***ing wrong with it, is there? <laughs> that, that is a real pleasure for me to know that you're like that. <laughs> I've seen Chris happy but never as happy as today and Lisa we have you to thank for that. Thank you for accept accepting him as he is with all of his many, many quirks. <laughs> Thank you for challenging him and not backing down. Thank you for being his best friend, his partner in life and now his wife. You have chosen each other over everything else that life has challenged you with for six years now. Keep doing that. Keep choosing each other. So I'll take each day I'm given and make the most of it. And even when it gets hard, I promise not to quit. It feels so good to be alive. It feels so good you're by my side. to love without condition, to support and encourage. Whether it be in times of lush growth or in drought, when things are challenging or seem effortless and easy. Whatever you face in life, I will face. I promise to love you as you deserve to be loved. I promise to laugh with you, cry with you and grow with you. I promise to support your hopes and dreams and to help you reach them. To our many sunrises and sunsets of the future, you have, we have chosen each other to make a wonderful life side by side for as long as we both shall live. I'll take each day I'm given and make the most of it. And even when it gets hard, I promise not to quit. It feels so good to be alive. It feels so good to be alive. Chris, you make us your bride.
Danielle and I are very different. She does the lovey-dovey favourite sister kind of stuff. <laughs> I'm here today for Lisa. <laughs> this isn't actually Chris's first marriage. <laughs> Chris and I got married when we were about five. <laughs> yeah, it was a pretty low budget wedding, a small ceremony. Um, I used Grand's crochet tablecloth as a veil. Dad gave me away, mum was the celebrant. Yeah, it was a strange time. <laughs> Good luck, I love you both, and Lisa, no returns. <laughs> Your two sisters adored you, and there was one word that haunted me through those years, and that was Chris! <laughs> and I smile to myself when I still hear that today. And now it's Lisa's voice as well. <laughs> Take my breath like a roller coaster.